We would like to thank our sponsors, Helicontext.com. Hi, we're back at Hilltop Shoot Club, and today I just want to run through a couple of things that we're sort of wearing while we're shooting. It's a freezing cold day, there's snow on the hills, it's about two degrees uh, air temperature, it's freezing cold. And the worst thing about that is if you're shooting on a day like this, is you know that incessant cold getting in on you with a bit of wind coming through, it's gonna put your game. If you're not comfortable while you're shooting, you're never going to shoot well. So it's good to wear the right type of clothing. So for what I'm wearing today, this is all by the Helicon range. I'm wearing a base two layer here. This is the undergarment. This is sort of, you wear this next to your skin. Uh, absolutely superb piece of kit. And uh, it, it has this sort of ribbing on the inside on the fleece. And that allows the air circulate through and keep nice and warm. This is the vest part here it also has a zip up collar if it gets really really cold i can zip it all the way up and that will keep me nice and warm underneath my utp pants here i'll get through to them in a second i also have the second part of the space layer and it's the leggings part again the last thing you want to do is be cold because if you're shivering at all or you're uncomfortable with the cold you're never going to shoot well second thing i'm wearing here today is the utp pants now uh, Trousers are trousers are trousers, but the thing is, uh, when you're shooting again, if that wind is coming through, which it is here, uh, the last thing you want is your legs to get cold, because that's going to set you all off, and uh, as I've already said, if you're not comfortable when you're shooting, uh, it's not going to go right for you. So, the UTP pants are great, there's great elasticity in the material, so that there's plenty you give, you're not uncomfortable wearing them, uh, they're nice and figure hugging, so they don't clatter up and get in the way, and yet, as I said, they have that free range of movement, which is so, so important. Um, the great thing about them, the material that's used them, it does stop the wind coming through. That's a great, great, great help. Up on the top here, I'm wearing the Gunfighter jacket. Now, this is in foliage it's green, it comes in black, it comes in tan, and it's a superb piece of kit. Uh, has all the different pockets and bits and pieces that you'd expect out of a quality jacket like this. The great thing is it's got that polar, super fine le uh, fleece on the inside that keeps the heat in. It does wick away any moisture and expel it. This is a size medium. Uh, I'm 15 stand and 6 foot 1, so if a medium fits me, it should fit most people of my size. Uh, the great thing about it is it's tight enough without being too restrictive uh, to allow me to do my clay pigeon shooting if I want to do that. And it's not going to get in the way if I'm doing pistol shooting or rifle shooting. It doesn't matter what uh, discipline I'm trying on the day. Uh, it doesn't get in the way and it functions perfectly. It has that Teflon dew point uh, coating on the outside which again keeps it slightly shower proof. It's not really 100% waterproof but then again most of the ranges that we're on are indoors here uh, until the summertime. So to be honest with you it, it'll do for everything I need it to do. Uh, and I said great the material is that a last, slightly elasticated material so I've got plenty of range of movement. Nothing's restricted. But most importantly is I'm warm. Now the only thing that's been cold on me today has been my face and my hands. My hands have to be free to shoot. You can wear gloves but I prefer not to. Um, so you have to live with that. And obviously I'm wearing ear defenders here and volley glasses because we're in a shooting range. So it's just a quick insight to you know, things that you can wear while you're shooting. And you know, it's not just a case of putting on any, any old clothing. You need to be comfortable, you need to be warm, especially this time of year, to shoot correctly. And wearing the right type of equipment is gonna always make your uh, experience more enjoyable. And that's what this should be, enjoyable. So that's it for this time from Oddie Sports Shooting, and we'll see you next time.